The 2011-2012 season will go down in the record books as the greatest season in Lehigh men's basketball history. Following a strong 2010-2011 campaign, the Mountain Hawks had their eyes firmly set on a Patriot League championship and NCAA March Madness tournament berth. This is the story of the 2011-2012 Patriot League champion, Lehigh Mountain Hawks. Watch me as I dance under the spotlight, listen to the people screaming on more and more Cause I create the feeling that keep them coming back Yeah, I create the feeling that keep them coming back A young but experienced so Mountain Hawks squad shattered a number of school records Including wins 27 and non-league wins 12 While tying the school record for Patriot League victories with 11 Lehigh's season high nine game winning streak came at an opportune time Beginning in mid-February and running through the Patriot League tournament and a historic 75-70 NCAA tournament win over Duke, which captured the nation's attention. It marked Lehigh's first ever NCAA tournament victory and only the sixth time a 15 seed has played in the round of 32. Guiding the Mountain Hawks was Dr. Brett Reed, who wrapped up his fifth season as Murray H. Goodman, 48, head coach. In his tenure on the sidelines, Reed owns by far the most victories by a Lehigh head coach in his first five seasons and has won 75% of his games at Stabler Arena, winning Patriot League championships in 2010 and 2012. His 59.9 career Division I winning percentage is tops among active Patriot League coaches. Lehigh challenged itself from the onset, playing teams from the Big East, Big 12, and Big 10 in their non-conference schedule. The Mountain Hawks showed they could compete with the nation's elite, taking a double-digit lead over St. John's on ESPN deep into the second half, losing by nine in front of 15,000 fans at Iowa State, and pushed eventual number one seed Michigan State on ESPNU. The Red Storm were fresh off the NCAA tournament in 2011 and previewed one of the top recruiting classes in the nation in 2012. Iowa State was an eventual 2012 NCAA tournament qualifier as an eight seed. Finally, at the time of the Lehigh Michigan State game in December, the Spartans were ranked 19th in the country, peaking at number four going into March Madness that featured three victories in a 48-hour span at the 2K Sports Classic, benefiting coaches versus cancer in Lynchburg, Virginia, beating Liberty, William & Mary, and Eastern Kentucky. Another memorable moment early in the season came at Wagner College, when Anthony DeRazio buried a three with less than 10 seconds on the clock to defeat the Seahawks, a team that ended the season with 25 wins by one point. In conference play, the eventual Patriot League champion Mountain Hawks won 11 regular season games prior to adding three more wins in the midst of their championship run, beating Colgate, American, and Bucknell for the automatic bid to the NCAA tournament. The regular season highlight win came at Bucknell, 
when C.J. McCollum hit a three at the buzzer to win 56-53. A play that reached as high as number two on ESPN's top ten plays of the day. For the second time in three years, Lehigh won the Patriot League with big-time contributions from C.J. McCollum and Gabe Knutson, scoring 29 and 23 points respectively. Lehigh's next game solidified the legacy of the 2011-2012 Mountain Hawks, shooting Coach Reed, C.J. McCollum, and the university into the national spotlight. On the NCAA's largest stage, the team executed a masterpiece, beating the Duke Blue Devils in a 75-70 thriller in Greensboro, North Carolina. A win that sent shockwaves throughout the NCAA tournament, the Lehigh Valley, and all around the United States. In the third round of the NCAA tournament, Lehigh outplayed the Xavier Musketeers for most of the first half. The game was tied with eight minutes left to play, but Lehigh could not hold on, losing 70-58. to 